Today's video is very strange because I reordered a candy club box when I was like in the middle of the night sleeping and I was I woke up in the morning and I saw the charge and I was like I've tried this before I didn't really want it so I called and I canceled I got my refund and everything and today a candy club box shows up on my doorstep so here I am. I guess I'm doing a mystery box unboxing for you all. Some of you today. might be thinking, why wouldn't you just send it back? Or, you know, if you didn't want it, why are you going to open this? Well, first off, it's candy. So once it's sent to somebody's house, you can't send it back. They're just going to throw it out. So I might as well keep it. And uh, it was a mistake on their part. So I get to keep the candy club box. And it was a mystery box. I have no idea what's going to be inside of this, and this is the first time that I'm opening it with you all. So the first Candy Club subscription video I did was awful. It was a fail. I did a video with a camera that I bought. It was like a $100 camera. Uh, quality was awful. And so now I'm going to do a new Candy Club unboxing. I'm kind of happy I'll get a little redemption here. Oh gosh, here we go. Hopefully I like them. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is already a little bit better. Wow. I don't think I got any of the same ones. I didn't get any of the same ones that I got before. Look how pretty this is. It's kind of fun. Just a little bit overpriced. That was my All right, thing. here we go. I'm going to start off with the Taste of Nature Cinnamon Bun Bites. I have a blast from the past here because I got last box, which I still even have. I think it was Funfetti Bites and I also got Oreo Bites or something like that. And i um, just gonna throw that on the floor. They didn't taste too great, so we'll see what this tastes like. So they're all individually wrapped as well. Ugh. Oh, that definitely smells like Cinnabons. Hmm. Oh my gosh, it is like I just took a bite of a Cinnabon, Cinnabon. That's pretty decent. Quite a bit in there, but I oh. went ahead and just unwrapped all of these because I feel like that would have taken way too much time. So I'm going to now open Airway Chocolate Drizzled Caramel Corn. Mm. Okay. Those are good. I would definitely get those at the store. Pretty much exactly like you'd think that chocolate drizzled caramel corn would taste like. The next one, Vital Rainbow Bricks. This is like a tangy and the sweet rainbow bite. Infused with a delicious and unique cream filling. Oh man, what is that gonna be like? Haven't got the cream filling yet. Hmm. It just tastes like a sour bite with a lot of layers. Interesting. We'll do this one next because it doesn't look like I'm really like these. This is Gustav's fruit and a I don't even know how to say that. Pastilles? Pastels? An elegant mix of beautifully bright and flavorsome jelly fruits. Oh. These are hard. Really hard. Sticking my teeth. 
They're okay. Definitely not something that I would just snack on. I didn't think I'd like those. Oh, no, I didn't like that. Even hard to swallow. All right. Uh, the next one, I can't tell what's what. I think this is the Oh My God Milk Chocolate Graham Cluster with peanut and toffee bits. Let's see. This tastes like something. Kind of like turtles a little, like Fannie Mae turtles. And it tastes like a pretzel. That's kind of cool. I'm assuming that's the gram. And then this is the Albanese milk chocolate peanut butter filled pretzels. Okay, maybe this is the graham cluster. No, no, this is definitely milk chocolate peanut butter filled pretzels. Mmm, this is my favorite. Mm hmm. That's amazing. And when you bite into this, it's like boom right in your face. I generally don't like peanut butter flavor anything, but that was pretty decent. So that's all of the candies. I tried them all for you here. I would give this box an overall rating of out of 10, 6.57. Reason being, I'm being very critical. Uh, it's very expensive. I feel like these things are, uh, some of them are things that you can go get at the store. And I still feel like that. I felt like that before. I think my last box, the difference between that and this is that the last box, I curated the box myself. So I knew exactly what was coming. I had an expectation for what they taste like. And I got excited and I started to get the thought in my mind about what it would taste like. And this was random and completely unexpected today. So... I didn't have this idea in my mind today and I was able to try them as I got it. So I feel like maybe that helps, even though I was more interested in curating my own box, having it randomized maybe kind of made it better. Although there's like the fruit thing that I knew I wouldn't like anyway, you'll get something like that as well where one or two of the candies that you are paying quite a bit of money for may not be what you like. So that's kind of the issue with randomized boxes. Uh, if you were interested, this is what it kind of looks like. And they always put little candies around the box or little circle things of candies here. And they're pretty decent sized items. There's a lot in them. Like I said, even it's been months since I ordered the other one. I still have those candies. Like I have two no four different kinds of candies out of the six I still have so they last a long time and you probably don't need them every month because this is a monthly subscription box and also just an FYI that if and when you want to cancel or you don't like your box or whatnot you have to call them uh they have an option to email but they don't get back right away even though they say they try to get back within 24 hours or so, I would definitely call, get it handled. They're very good on customer service. That's kind of bumped up a couple points for my rating for them. So anyway, Candy Club, pretty good company overall. They have a good idea. It's based off candy that is curated for you. That is my mystery subscription that came today. As always, guys, please subscribe to my channel. Click the bell button so that you can get alerts for when I post, which I post at least twice a week, if not more. And give me some feedback below. Comment your thoughts. What did you think about the box? Have you ever ordered Candy Club boxes? Do you have any questions for me now that I've ordered a randomized and a specially curated box for myself? And please follow my Twitter accounts. I'll have the link here, my Instagram account. I'm just trying to get out there. I'm a, you know, a small town girl trying to pursue her dream of being a YouTuber, a model. I love all those things. And this is a great hobby and I love to share it all with you. Anyway, as always, have a beautiful day.